everybody, my name is Sarah. Welcome to Kids Following Jesus. Now last week was the first Sunday of Advent and we talked about how that means that we are preparing for Jesus to come. Now this week for the second Sunday of Advent, we are going to talk about John the Baptist who is helping prepare people for Jesus' coming. Now let's go to our Bibles and we are going to be back in Mark, but we're going to look at chapter 1. And we're looking at verses 4 through 8. And so John came, he baptized people in the desert. He also preached that people should be baptized and turn away from their sins. Then God would forgive them. All the people from the countryside of Judea went out to him. All the people from Jerusalem went too. When they admitted they had sinned, John baptized them in the Jordan River. John wore clothes made out of camel's hair. He had a leather belt around his waist, and he ate locusts and wild honey. Here is what John was preaching. After me, one will come who is more powerful than I am. I'm not good enough to bend down and untie his sandals. I baptize you with water but he will baptize you with the Holy Spirit. So now let me tell you a story. And you're in the story. So imagine this. You are going to school, but it's a brand new school, a brand new building. So you're sitting in a new classroom. Now, you have to leave this classroom and go to a different room, and you have to go by yourself. Are you getting nervous? So you start out, you go into the hallway and you make a turn, you look around and you realize you are lost. Now, fortunately, there's a teacher in the hallway. You don't know the teacher because this is a new school for you. Do you think that teacher is going to help? The answer, of course, is yes, that teacher will help you. So you go up and you explain to the teacher that you're lost and the teacher looks at you and says, it's okay, do you see that corner back there? That's where you made the wrong turn. Go back to that corner and turn the other way. And that will get you to where you need to be. Now, John the Baptist is like this teacher that we don't know in the hallway. Now he's out in the wilderness but all the people who are coming to him, he's telling them, repent. And that means turn around. So if, if you make a wrong turn, then you're able to turn around and go the other way. If you make a mistake, you can make it right. So that is what John the Baptist is telling people. Repent, turn around, and that will get you to where you want to be, which is with Jesus. Now, can you think of anybody in your life that's kind of like John the Baptist? Someone who helps you remember Jesus? Well, this week, I want you to think of who those people might be. And I want you to name each one and say a special prayer for those people and thank them for reminding you how important Jesus is. All right, everyone, let's pray together. Dear God, thank you for Jesus, and thank you for the people who help remind us of him. Please help us to be a reminder for each other. Amen. Thanks for joining me this week for Kids Following Jesus. We'll see you next week.